So we're going to start on the baseball diamond here. Regional finals scheduled for Wednesday, and in Class D North Baseball, the Bangor Christian Patriots are looking to capture another banner. The Patriots finished the regular season with just one loss and are heading into the finals, gearing up for top-seeded Katahdin. They knocked off reigning regional champs Machias in their quarterfinal matchup, and then over the weekend battled for nine innings with Woodland before walking off with the victory, an experience they say was crazy. But like we said, now they are gearing up for a dangerous Cougars team, but the Patriots are just focused on playing their game. We're pretty good. We're feeling confident. I mean, they're the number one seed. They're going to be a good team, so we just got to come ready to play. We just got to focus on what we do well and stick to what we've been doing all season and what the coaches have been preaching to us all year. They're a great team. They're the number one seed, and they've earned the number one seed. It's a regional title game. It's, it's a big deal to us. We feel confident to play our own game, but, um, you know, can't underestimate them. They're number one seed. It's an honor to play them. We just got to stay focused on ourselves, do what we do best, and it's a good team, so they're going to come and play. we got to come play as well. Bangor Christian is led by a tight group of six seniors, including Mr. Main Baseball finalist Jason Libby. And this group has been playing together for ages. They have been knocking at the door for a while of a regional title, and it would mean the world for them to knock off Katahdin and bring home the program's first regional title since 2017, especially with how close all these guys are. It, it's like a family, you know, just a bunch of tight-knit tight friends. and. Um, Good coaches, great coaches, great friends, great fans. We've, we've all won it. You know, we came to work every single game. We know every game's going to be a war or battle, and we do what we want it. A lot of us are really close friends. You know, it's a smaller school, so we're kind of not forced to be friends, but we are just really good friends on and off the field, so that's definitely good. helps us. You know, we're all really close friends. We bond on and off the field, and we just have a lot of fun with what we do. It would be crazy, you know. Um, it, it'd honestly be like a dream come true. 